So when I paint something, sim I spend a long time in simplifying it. I start off with the thing that inspires me and I think, right, I could do something with that. I get the, uh, as you do with the sunset, if something triggers, I think that's fantastic. I could, the design and the colour, and I and instantly uh, I have a, a picture in my head, an idea. Uh, so then I put that down and I will simplify. I'll do maybe uh, half a dozen or a dozen variations on that to see which design achieves uh, the what I want, the magical presence. Uh, and uh, so uh, that's what I concentrate on. So the do a painting for me could uh, go, it, it just keeps going until I get that when I look at it I get I think it's got it now the difference between uh, the, your best and not your best is you when you feel you look at it and you think well it, it's got it and, but some others you look at and you think my god that really has there's something about it. I don't know what it is but it's absolutely it's a humdinger and uh, you know you've hit it directly. So I know when I've achieved the nearest thing uh, to what's in my head, uh, uh, mind, and uh, the one that uh, hasn't quite achieved it. So it does have a, you have a variation in where you've got nearest to the actual magical presence. And I think, uh, I always think it's where people uh, who aren't interested in art, but they go out and they say, uh, as I say, uh, at a sunset or some view, uh, this, there's something about that, they say that it's wonderful. Uh, and that's, uh, that's what, uh, in the, the picture, that when I get to that stage in a painting, uh, I stop. And I, I, if I don't get there, I always think, well, it's not really one of my best. So you know you are aware when you've achieved it. But you can't, sometimes it means that where you have uh, an object on a table on the left-hand side, you might think, well, there's something wrong here, something quite wrong uh, so you shift it to the right hand side and that does it so you alter your design to get to the arrangement that gives you that now all these people like uh, Vermeer he always I don't know how well again it's magic how he does it but all his paintings have that stillness and uh, presence they're just he's managed to get that uh, uh, Piero della Francesca, Rembrandt, uh, there are a whole lot, uh, Cezanne, they all have that uh, uh, in various uh, amounts.